Nope. No, actually. Oops. Uh, come on, let's go. Let's go. Let's get on this train. Yes, we're gonna break out of this fucking place. Hopefully, except uh, your mech's gonna die. Prop oh fuck! Flashbang! Fuck! We're gonna we're gonna get tortured and shit. Fuck! Fuck! Okay, so when we set off the nukes in one of the games, uh, that signal or whatever that we heard was the jammers temporarily going offline. It irradiated on the surface. My father just kept lying. Lying to you, to me, to everyone. The whole fucking world. And not even batting an eye. Uh Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Stop the engine immediately and come out with your hands above your head. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck bags. Well, fuck. <laughs> that was just a warning. If you do not comply, we will shoot to kill. Fuck me, that's a lot. But look at all the machine guns. Happy now? Is this what you were hoping How for? How is this his fault? You knew everything and never said anything. Yes! Warren! Stop the engine immediately! Oh, fuck! Are you okay? Yeah, just a scratch. Okay, uh, okay, you stop uh, it. But I must warn you, my brakes are not in great condition. Your back is going to start slowing down. Let them think we are surrendering. Ah, finally some good stuff. Now, keep writing your stuff. Well, the grenades will barely scratch their pain, so... How about from these? Not enough explosives. Unless we put everything we have in their firebox. Please, let me do it, Colonel, sir. I will be appointing the volunteers here. Our team will do it. It's 
my mess. I gotta fix it. I don't think those guys quite, um...
fuck. Wait, what? Wait, what? I changed my filter. I I changed my filter. What the fuck? Was it because my glass cracked too much? Okay, so I need to place it in the boiler. Okay. So this is gas. Okay. It's gonna go boom. This is gonna be great. Boom. Oh fuck. Oh shit. Oh fuck. Oh no. Oh dear. This is. Oh. Oh shit. Am I glad? Oh, that's. I got shot in the face. Like, look at that shit in the corner. Wow. He sounds so happy about that, but also slightly angry. We stopped a hundred clicks from Moscow to check our Geiger counters. The green. As if they're in a conspiracy. Still, this amazing piece of news doesn't really impress anyone that much. The guys are all confused as to what to do next. And I... I'm just waiting for answers. And hoping the commander, whom until recently I trusted implicitly, is going to be extremely persuasive in his reasoning. Should probably plug my phone in. Have shared that before? 
say before Artyom took that radio outside and caught all that radiation? No! I only got briefed half a year ago under a strict to talk to die policy. And then had to tell my people we were securing a weather station. Sir, with all the respect, if we can't go back, maybe we should advance and move on? I have an idea, but... Uh, Artyom, rather than carrying on with this silent disapproval of yours, check the airwaves. We should be out of the jamming range by now, so give it your best try. Look for transmissions from the Ark. Do you understand? So you mean the space station that fell from the sky? Okay. Not actually cannon. Jamming station. Shot off the guards. Destroyed a patrol train. And ran away from Moscow. Who even needs a trial when the case is so clear? There's no way back now. Which means we have to continue moving forward. Command. What are you talking about? The Moscow Defense Command. Have you ever heard of the Invisible Watchers? I have, but they're just an urban legend. Attention. Attention. Not at all. They are command. Speaking from the Ark Project base. Wait a moment, what was that? Everyone's still loyal to the clock. Proceed to the rally point. Rally point lost. Listen, everyone. Is this what you had in mind? Yes, this is it. The Ark Project is a whole city underground. Enormous stores, machines, the best experts. It is the Commander General's HQ. All of the country's leaders are there. They have already started the restoration work. We will tell them that Moscow is alive. It wasn't all for nothing. Everything will change, everything! Do you get it? A new life is starting for all the survivors of the world! Yeah, yeah! We're gonna die. Are there any single women in that place? <laughs> Great reaction. So I think the moment calls for... <clears throat> Bring it out, then. Bring what out, Colonel? Sir? That thing that's been sloshing about in your canteen. <laughs> Do you think I'm deaf or what? Ah, that. Uh, just a moment. I, I thought my ears were deceiving me. <laughs> 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 it's not a short trip to the Urals, so we should make ourselves comfortable, I guess. Well, let's name this bucket of bolts at the very least, eh? It's about time. Let's go around and be I'm going to check to see how far away the Ural Mountains are from Moscow. <laughs> Even better. Oh, come how about on. Aurora, the rolling goddess of dawn and a cruiser of uh, uh, you know what? That's better. <laughs> Not bad. I like it. Ah, beautiful name. Sounds okay, but the cruiser of what? Yeah, I'll tell you later. Looks like it's decided. <laughs> Let's drink to the Oh, okay. Um, where exactly are the Euro Mountains? <sighs> Euro hey, Mountains Mateo, are. Let's take a look at that map. Oh, that's surprisingly close. Okay. Found it. It's only like a couple hundred miles, it looks like. Wow, that's some distance. I wonder how long it will take. It's cool as fuck. How are you, Alyosha? 